called as an orthoboric acid. You may be knowing that uh, sometimes we uh, we see that H P D O three is an orthoboric acid in some textbook. You will see. So today we will tell why this is known as orthoboric acid. Why not boric acid? So whenever we having so we know the structure of the boric acid is like this. This is three O H group here, one here. Another OH here and another OH here. So this is boric acid. We used to say boric acid, but this is known as. orthoboric acid so why so so this is because whenever we having more than 2 oh group in a compound then we'll call that compound as a prefix prefix ortho so here the, there is 3 oh group in this compound h3po3 so we'll use prefix ortho and we'll call it as orthoboric acid so that's why this boric acid is called as orthoboric acid. So you may be knowing this. Uh, another example is H three PO four. This is phosphoric acid. But it is commonly known as orthophosphoric acid this is the correct name why so so the structure of this uh, h3po3 you all know the structure of the uh, h3po3 is like so this is the structure of h3po3 so as i told that whenever we having more than 2 oh group in a compound then we will use prefix ortho. So, this is known as ortho phosphoric acid. So, this is the concept behind the ortho in uh, molecule why we are used the ortho. Thank you.